On November 30th, 2013, Paul Crouch, co-founder of the Trinity Broadcasting Network, passed away. If we were to write an honest eulogy for this man, perhaps this is what it would say. He was a man who prospered. In fact, he personified the prosperity doctrine, building a life of luxury on the wallets, purses, and personal donations of the indoctrinated, the brainwashed, the gullible, the vulnerable, and the weak. He offered prayers and promises to the oppressed and downtrodden from his opulent television studio, and most certainly during the limousine rides to one of his many mansions. And as he cruised the skies on his $50 million private jet. He gave to the needy, as when his wife Jan needed her own private mansion next to his. And she also needed a $100,000 mobile home, specifically for the family dogs. Paul Crouch was the king of bling, and his expensive toys, if exchanged for cash, would have undoubtedly fed the mouths and housed the families of thousands upon thousands of impoverished and afflicted souls across the planet. His life was marked by big money, big hair, and promises of big blessings in exchange for big donations. And of course, the faithful did give. Cash, checks, and credit card numbers. The viewing audience said, please take our money. And Paul Crouch Sr. said, thanks a million. Honestly, does Paul Crouch deserve a hero's tribute? Are the lives of his fans and followers truly better because of his television appearances, preaching, and prayers? Or was he an opportunist who built a multi-million dollar life of luxury and privilege upon an offering plate?